So uh, today we'll be checking out our new plugin. That's the WooCommerce Learning Management System plugin. Now this particular plugin introduces a new product type that is the course product type. And this helps the admin to create multiple training online courses as well. For the courses, the admin can create multiple content sections and can add new content such as a video or PDF files under the content and the assignment tab. Apart from that, the admin can create memberships for the online courses, which allow the customers to take the benefits of the discounts for the course products there. So today I'll be showing you the workflow of the uh, WooCommerce Learning Management System at the store front and uh, we'll be seeing uh, how the courses can be viewed and the details of the courses. Then we'll see how to purchase the courses without membership. Then we'll be seeing how to purchase a membership. Then we'll see how to purchase the courses with the membership. And uh, lastly, we'll be checking out the uh, courses that we have purchased under the my uh, account section there so before we proceed further please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end and if you find this particular video helpful then do kindly give it a thumbs up so right now you can see that i'm at the woocommerce uh, web store and here i'm on the courses uh, category and this displays the complete list of uh, uh, courses uh, that have been created by the web store admin now uh, we have uh, incorporated a new uh, product type that's the course product type that allows uh, you to create courses as products from the admin backend and those get then visible here at the storefront now here you can see that uh, I have a lot of uh, courses that I've created for this demo today and for example let's go to the uh, business economy that's for $600 so I'll just tap on that and that will bring up the details of the course here itself so here is the business economy and the price is six hundred dollars so now the thing is uh, that uh, if uh, you are not purchasing the membership then you'll have to make the payment uh, that is for the complete six hundred dollars otherwise if you are purchasing the uh, membership first and depending upon the uh, setup of the uh, discount there on that particular uh, membership you'll get that amount of that amount would be lessened out from this particular uh, thing as well and here you can see that uh, the uh, membership uh, uh, amount that needs to be paid so right now we don't have uh, we haven't uh, purchased any course so that's how we can go to the course uh, section check the complete listing of the courses and then we can tap on the particular course that we want to check out so we'll tap here on the business economics and that will bring up the uh, complete details of the product itself and if I scroll down here on the product page of the uh, course you can see it's the business economy the price is $600 the skill level is basic the course language is English the number of enrolled uh, users is one course sections are three assignments are two and the requirements for this particular course are basic knowledge so from here we can directly add it to the cart and make a check out there uh, and apart from that here you can see the course content by tapping here on the course content so here we have the different topics uh, like the business economy basics introduction assignments so if I tap here we can find the uh, basic details there we can also uh, tap here on the preview button to check the preview uh, that has been added for the course there by the admin and accordingly the customers can uh, preview this one uh, as a video or in a PDF file format as well as required by and set up by the admin from the back end for the course product type so say, similarly you can find the details of the introduction as well and uh, the assignments as well so that's how you can uh, check out the uh, particular course product now let's uh, add this product to the cart uh, without the membership and let's place the order so I'll just tap here on the add to cart button so the business economy course would be added into my cart and then we can make a check out thereafter so we've added in it into the cart and uh, now let's uh, proceed to the checkout so I'll just tap here on the checkout button. Here I'll be filling up the details. I'll choose the uh, the payment method and I'll just tap here on the uh, place order button thereafter. So you can see the order number is 63 and the order details here you can see that business economy course uh, has been purchased for $600 there. Now uh, let's go to the my account section. Now the customers would have two different uh, uh, account options there one is my courses and the membership plans 
under the my courses they'll find the complete listing of the courses that they have purchased so right now we have just purchased one uh, course there uh, and after that particular order has been in uh, has been uh, completed by the admin that particular course would be visible under the my courses apart from that here we have the membership plans as well so if i tap on the membership plans we'll be able to find the complete listing of membership plans that have been added by the admin so here you can see that we have the percentage discount for the courses reduced cost for the all courses free access to all courses so we can purchase any one of the memberships there uh, until now we are seeing without the membership how we can purchase the courses and uh, we purchase one course that should be now displayed under the my courses so uh, let's uh, complete the order and let's check the my course under the my courses section so in the back end i'll just be uh, completing this particular course and uh, then we'll uh, again go to the front end to see the rest of the workflow there so i'll say this status is complete and i'll update this thing up order has been updated as you can see so let's go back uh, and let's refresh the page here and now our particular course would be visible so here you can see that the course is now visible to the customer and he can view the course from here by tapping on the view course button and then he can find the details of the same so here you can see that uh, now if we come to the product page it says that you've already purchased this course so we have already purchased the course there with the different uh, sections there uh, and with the preview as well now let's uh, purchase a uh, membership there and then we'll purchase a course once again so let's go to the membership plans and let's choose uh, 10 10 dollars fixed discount on all courses so i'll just tap here on the purchase button this would uh, this membership would be added into the cart let's make a checkout thereafter i'll just place the order And after the order has been placed so the order has been placed let's go to my account membership plans so here you can see that uh, we had purchased the reduced cost for all courses so we need to uh, complete this uh, particular order from the back end first and then uh, this particular uh, course will show purchased so for that let's go back and here I'll go to memberships uh, I'm sorry for that we'll have to go to the orders under the WooCommerce so we'll, let's go to the order section so here's our order number 64 and let me set it as completed update now uh, let me refresh this page once again now you can see that uh, we have uh, purchased the membership and kindly note that uh, if you have already purchased a membership and if you purchase any other membership after that then the old one gets uh, invalid also we have the expiry time for each of the uh, uh, courses as well so here's the membership plans and how we can purchase a membership plan and uh, here we have my courses the courses that we have purchased now let's go back to the courses section and let's uh, add this course so now because we have the what we say as the membership and we are getting a 10 percent uh, 10 dollar fixed uh, discount there let's see the details for the same on the product page so here we are on the uh, course uh, product type and here you can see that we have the membership price for $490 we are getting a $10, uh, $10 fixed uh, discount there because we have purchased one uh, membership there uh, for a $10 off so the actual price was $500 now we just need to uh, pay the $490 there and rest of the course details are here along with the previews as well as you can see and that's the same and now we can add this product into the cart with the particular discount because we have purchased one uh, membership there and uh, we are getting a ten dollar discount here so we'll just add it to the cart and we can make a checkout thereafter so you can see that the discount is available there in the cart as well and it's for uh, 490 dollars only the initial cost was uh, 500 dollars so uh, yes that was much about the woocommerce uh, learning management system at the storefront how the customers can uh, view the uh, courses how they can uh, find the particular details of the courses and how they can check the course details how they can purchase the membership there and get the discounts on the course products so yes that was much about the same and uh, i hope it helped you out in understanding the flow of the same if you still have any questions, queries, suggestions or requirements, then kindly do reach back to us at 
support at the rate of webcool.com or you can raise a ticket at webcool.uvdesk.com and apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then kindly do give it a thumbs up and lastly thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead